Hey everybody, it's Chris from Prepare Mind 101. This is kind of shooting gorilla video style today. Because uh, I was out, I'm running around doing things for the other things that I do. And I had a thought. It would be a perfect, quick video. And it's basically an update video about something that I reviewed like five years ago. And how it's holding up and that's applicable today. And it's a good thing that I did because when I looked it up on Amazon, I found that these things are a lot cheaper. So if you want to find out about a product that I'm sure you know because you looked at the thumbnail and read the title. See, it's never a surprise. But I always think it is when I'm shooting the freaking video. Let me tell you about the greatest boots I've ever bought. So don't go away. got on YouTube and I looked up to see when I first did the video on these boots it was just over five years ago and I've been using the same pair ever since and when it gets nasty out I pretty much wear these things all winter and they still rock and they're still holding up so these are the muck Arctic sports now before I get too much into my experience with these I want to point out that I looked up on Amazon and you can actually now get the Arctic Pros, which have got a little bit more insulation and go up higher for less than what I paid for these five years ago. I saw them on Amazon for 109 bucks. I'm like, 109 bucks for Muck Arctic Pro boots? If you spend three days outside in the winter, it would be well worth your money to go buy those friggin' boots. They're magic boots. Probably didn't know that. <clears throat> anyway, I can't tell you everything about the insulation, but my experience with these is these are about the only boots I've ever owned that actually kept my feet warm over an extended period of time outside. With, no with usually nothing more than a good quality pair of wool socks wool socks and these and you're good to go now on rare occasions like we're supposed to have in a couple days when you get that crazy freaking insane polar vortex bs you know it might not hurt to throw uh, a toe warmer in there but for the most part it ain't gonna kill you these things work they work they hold up they're waterproof so with five years of use you know and when it like I said when it gets bad I, and I leave the house you know a couple years I was wearing these things almost every day you can see that the treads are still holding up on them I think Will still has his original pair of Arctic Sports but people that work outside and I forget about the woods and all that stuff let's just say you just work outside You've got some insane job like you work on electrical poles you're killing yourself if you don't have something like this because you get some of the fanciest oh come on wind let's do this as i was saying you get some of the fancy winter boots that i see people buy that you know 300 some bucks and they still complain that their, their feet get cold those boots freaking work and since we still got a couple months of winter I thought it would be worthwhile to bring it up again because here's a product that has withstood the test of time and extended use that I cannot recommend enough and it's just an added bonus that I look it up on Amazon and find out that now they're cheaper so at this point you know I got the Arctic Sports because they were a little bit uh, and, and yes, look, no eyeliner. That's just it's optical illusion that comes with hat shadow. <laughs> Be surprised how much that comes up. It's like, no, I don't listen to my chemical romance. Anyway, as I was saying, 
uh, when I originally got the uh, Arctic Sports, it was because they were significantly less expensive than the Arctic Pros. But I still had no complaints. You know, Will was like, oh, you got to get the Arctic Pros, you got to get the Arctic Pros. Well, I certainly didn't notice the difference. I mean, it's not like my feet were cold. So what do I got to complain about? But now, like I said, Amazon Prime, I just looked at it and saw the taller ones, the warmer ones, for 109 bucks. So if you're in need of such a thing, I'm just putting that out there again. Ugh. Arm's getting tired. Like I really should I really should just take my camera with me when I leave the house. Never know when inspiration is going to strike. But if you're in need of such a thing, pick them up. I mean, you will get so much use out of those. And they'll make your experience in the outdoors during the winter a thousand times better. And it's less than the price of that Becker Kephart that I just showed recently. You know. You can't beat that. You can't beat that at all. And one other little bonus thing that I've mentioned before when it comes to staying warm out here, and I don't have this on today because I'm not out, out in the woods, but one of the biggest things that I do, you know, I do, I, I've got the Lester River hoodie and I've got the, uh, the anorak from Weatherwool. But when I'm wearing other things, the most effective thing that I have in my arsenal is about six sweaters that are 100% wool that I paid $3 each for at Goodwill. So just go to Goodwill or Salvation Army or any of those type of stores, go to the sweater rack and just keep going through them and find your size or a size higher and find anything that says 100% wool. I mean, merino wool, yeah, that's, that's ideal, but it doesn't matter as long as it's 100% wool and then you can use that as one of your layers when you're outside it's going to make things just extraordinarily more comfortable for you so that's all i got for right now i uh, just wanted to put that in your head again in case uh, you're in the market for such a thing if you're just outside and you're you're tired of your feet being cold check those out i mean that's that was a i'm half tempted i don't need them those boots are still good, but I'm half tempted to get those freaking Arctic Pros just because 109 bucks for those is like a steal. So, I'll, uh, since it's Amazon, I'll add them to the store, and I'll add the Arctic Sports to the store too in case the Pros get sold out, because either one works. Uh, I've never even had a pair of Arctic Pros. But that's all I got for right now. My arm's getting tired. Chris from Prepare My 101. Thanks for watching. Be sure to click a like, share, and subscribe. All the links to the sponsors and the affiliates and everybody that makes this channel keep going is down below. I'll be back in another video here soon, so see you then.